Hey guys, Pablo with BND, and today in our Reddit top post, we're gonna be taking a look at top baggers of all time. All right, and if you guys haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notifications bell and leave a comment at the end of the video so you guys can qualify for our giveaway of five $30 gift cards and a possible Xbox One or PS4. All depend on, on the revenue that I get until 10,000 subscribers. But let's start with the video. I teach swimming to kids for free, even though I was offered money. Mommy demands that I have to teach her son exclusively and to give her the money offered as I don't need it. Hello, you're the lady who teach swimming, right? I got your number from Sanjita. Can you teach my son also? Yeah, sure. She said she offered to pay, but it's free. Is that true? I can't pay. Free, right? I can't pay, I'm a single mom. Hello? Please reply. Hello, sir? Hey, yes, they're free. I'm in office, I won't be able to respond right away. Wow, that's rude. I want to know what time today I should bring my son to the pool. I'm sorry, but today I already informed everyone that I wanted to swim alone today. I'll message you the next time I'm teaching, probably after three days. I usually teach the kids from 3 to 5 p.m. Can you come at 1 today and teach him? 1 to 3 is more warm than 3 to 5. I know you have flexible timing. Can you reply faster? I can't teach at 1 because of work. It is already past 12 and today I really feel stressed and I need to blow up some steam. I don't want to teach today. I already told everyone that. From next time, I will inform you also. That's not fair. I already told him that he can go swimming today. Give me one good reason to tell him, else he's gonna cry. One, I am not teaching today. Two, I already canceled. I can't uncancel with everyone this late. That's even better. You can teach him alone. Those brats got free class for a month. You need to make up for that with my son. What? I can't teach just for your son. Why not? He has anxiety issues. You have to teach him alone. I am not a certified trainer. I don't want to be responsible for the safety of a kid with anxiety in a pool with death twice his size. I think you should get someone else. When I say anxiety, I don't mean like that. He just doesn't like other kids. Just teach him exclusively for one month. After that, you can put him with everyone. They got more classes than him. It is not fair. So you start teaching him from tomorrow at 1. It is better to be out of the pool by 3. That way, no one gets sick. Also, he doesn't have goggles. Bring an extra pair tomorrow or let him use yours until I buy one. I can't swim daily. If I go swimming today, it will be at least two days before I swim again. And I am not gonna teach anyone exclusively. Wow, you're such a selfish bitch. He's just a kid. Don't you have any heart? I am a single mom and I already told him. So, tomorrow at one, I can see that you haven't seen my message. I will throw him in the pool tomorrow at one. If something happens to him, you are responsible. Whatever, you're probably a lousy teacher. You're such a nasty, horrible person. My son doesn't deserve this. I don't know what I did to deserve this. Why is everyone so selfish and unhelpful these days? You have flexible timings. You work less hours than me. You earn more than me. Those women are rich enough that they can afford to get a swim instructor, but no, they want only free stuff that my son needs. You're so privileged that you don't need money. You freaking refuse money that people are ready to pay. They are ready to give money and you don't need money. Do you know how much I need that money? I'm a single mom. You should get the money from them and give it to me. You're privileged. You should give it to me. I need it more than you. If you won't teach my son alone, 
you should at least give the money to me. Reply me. I can see that you read the message, woman. Encountered one on Reddit. I received platinum a while back and it came with 700 complimentary Reddit coins. So I've been giving silver to post comments that I enjoyed. Apparently, it's not enough. Should probably purchase more RC from my money to give them gold minimum. Kuroneko stories liked your comments so much that they awarded it, giving you Reddit silver. Here's a note that was included. Made me laugh, have a silver. As a reward, you get some special flair on your comment. And that's it, very dapper. Dude, seriously, if it made you laugh, you could have gilded me gold or platinum. Silver's useless, you cheap ass. Next time, save for at least gold or shove it up yours. No reply? Get off your high horse ass. I saw your dangerous cosplay and I guess you're ugly on the inside and outside. Uh, what? LOL. I'm sorry that my silver offended you? Do you go watch comedy shows expecting the best seats for the cheapest price? Then don't guild funny comments silver if they made you laugh. It's useless. I want gold minimum now. Hello? Whoa, very funny. 10 out of 10. Hope your hedgehog closed his other eye out. Bitch, you suck. Friend of my ex has been using my Netflix details without my knowledge for years. Calls me cheap. Hey, have you paid your Netflix account? Douchebag smile. Who is this? I don't have your number saved. It's douchebag. Can you please pay it tonight? I haven't spoke to you in years. How and why do you have my Netflix details? Your ex-girlfriend gave it to me when you two were seen. You have got to be freaking kidding. I'll be changing my password right away. Why you being a dick? What difference will that make? I have it set to log straight away. Douchebag laughing. Just pay it. I'm trying to watch something. You're not using my account anymore. I can't believe the chick of it. Lose my number, please. Whatever. You can't even afford the 10 pounds. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. The irony of someone say I can't afford to pay for something that they have been leeching off me for over two years. Not that it's any of your business, but I've changed banks, so they tried claiming for my old closed one. What do you mean? Uh? It's not letting me log in now, just pay it. I have. But you won't be able to use it without the new password. What difference does it make if you're paying for it anyway? I have nothing to do tonight now, and I really want to watch Netflix. Angry douchebag face. Then pay for your freaking on. Done with this now, blocked. She was too good for you, cheap ass. Ha 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 ha. Two weeks. Hi there. I was wondering what the turnaround time for a custom desk is. I need the height to be 700 millimeters, with enough to fit triple 24 inch monitors side by side. I'd like a keyboard sized area at the front, slanted forward for ease of typing gaming. Hey, I have a template for that exact design, around two weeks before we can start it currently. Oh, can you do it sooner by any chance? I was referred by your buddy. I'm sorry, two weeks from now is the best I can do at the moment. We're quite busy as my buddy stopped importing and rely on us now. Thank you. I'll inform your buddy that you weren't helpful at all, and they'll pull the contract. How long now? Still two weeks. I'll seriously notify Mark, and I'll advise him to not use you anymore, if you can't do better than two weeks. Huh? Dos weeks. I'm not joking. Huh? Wait a second, I'm on the phone with Mark. You're not... Uh, he said two weeks. Huh? He's calling you now. Hello? I can't believe you actually snitched to him. You don't even know my name. I said some dude with your number is saying he wants to discuss pulling our mutually beneficial contract, Mark. Would you like to chat with him? Okay, look. I'll do you a favor since you're so nice. So, how long already? I just rechecked my schedule. And... Well... 
hang on, just crunching some numbers. If you say two weeks, I swear. Ah, uh, I better not say anything then. I wouldn't want you to swear. Just say it. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh my god, how long does it take? Never mind, screw you. Three weeks. Screw you! Never make a bill of sale that shows less than what you sold the car for. Quick backstory. I just sold my 2006 BMW 750Li to this lady's son for 4000 which was already a pretty good deal. The car had 130,000 miles on it, and that price was nearly 2000 less than KBB. Anyway, one week later, she texts me today, saying the following. Crazy freaking lady. Hi, I just looked at my son's bill of sale while we're at the DMV, getting a tag for the car and to put it on my insurance. And it says he bought the car for 400, not 4,000. Either want my 3,600 back or I'm going to call the police. I sold your son the car for 4,000. Lance asked me if I would put 400 on the bill of sale so he would only have to spend $28 on taxes instead of 280 I told him I already filled out the TGE title. Your son typed that up and I never signed it. If you look at the title of the car, it has both our signatures on it and it says $4,000. I even told your son that won't fly with the DMV because they go off the title, not the bill of sale, which doesn't even have my signature. I didn't sign that damn piece of paper. You're only getting your son into trouble if you do that. He's 21, he's a big boy. Maybe let him make his own decisions and stop bugging me. He's an idiot when it comes to buying things. That is why I'm taking care of this. You're a goddamn thief and I am on my way to your house with the police. My husband is ex-military and will beat the 4,000 out of you, you son of a bitch. Either you're joking right now or you honestly didn't just threaten me over text. You know I can show this to the police if and when you come here. You can't be this stupid. I am home all day and I'll be waiting. But you really can't be this stupid. Give me back my money. Okay, that's all you had to say. No need to act that way, come on. Really? Frick no, get bent. I'll be waiting here if you show up with the cops with this convo printed out, you freaking lunatic. Hey guys, I would like to thank everyone that got to the end of the video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Give me a comment on the video, give me a like or dislike, and hit the notification bell. And I'll see you guys Friday for a veteran's point of view. I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you then.